hey guys welcome back to my channel it's jasmine lee and today's video is going to be a quick little mini review slash swatch video featuring juvia's place so i got four different palettes i have the zulu the douche or douche i'm not really sure how to pronounce that and then the saharan blush volumes one and two she was having a bogo sale so it was buy one get one free on these and then each of these were 15 dollars so my total order was about 54 bucks and some change i don't think that's awful considering how much i got um considering there's palettes out there for 40 and 50 dollars for just one palette and for some of those uh brands the quality don't match if we're being honest so let's just get straight into this video i have my wipes here so i'm just gonna be wiping my arm clean after i'm done with each swatch and we are going to go ahead and start with the zulu so the zulu eyeshadow palette is nice and colorful it comes with nine shades you get orange yellow brown a shimmery teal shimmery green teal purple pink and a rose gold type of color so i'm gonna go ahead and swatch these i'm gonna do all the mattes first and then i'm gonna swatch the the shimmers last so i'm gonna go ahead and start orange is all the matte shades but so we have this lime green that's really pretty and so soft wow that's pretty and then there's this blue oh these feel so good they feel so good going on my arm oh my god it's pretty it's like so freaking smooth and soft and oh these melts okay these really do melt and then there is this rose gold. Why did I shift? Mess around and layered that over the green so it's gonna look green. Hold on. Alright, now I'm going to go into the rose gold once again with the clean finger. And that is how that looks. Wow, these, these feel so good. I'm sorry, guys. So that's what all of them look like. And again, this was the Zulu palette. Very cute packaging. It has like your little Nubian queen on the front. And then you have all your colors inside. There are no names on this palette. So everything is pretty much true to color though. Like everything is what it looks like. There's no surprises except for maybe this pink that kind of looks gold in the light. So yeah, that's the Zulu. Next up, we have the ice cream palette that's what we're gonna call it today because i have no idea how to say that palette's name arms clean next palette so you have this really pretty character on the front once again representation of motherland and then you have these super pretty shades now this palette is what <laughs> okay this palette is what convinced me to go ahead and get the Zulu. This palette just, it was just nice. And these weren't on a buy one, get one free. So at this point, I was just being extra. So I'm gonna go ahead and swatch them. We have chocolate. Ooh, that was rich. You see that? That was a very rich brown, very rich swatch. Like that swatch was not playing with me at all. All right, next up, creme, and this is a pink matte shade. And then we have custard, which is the color you see in the very center of the palette, and it's this, uh, not lavender, it's, it's violet maybe, like a violet color. And then we have berry mousse, and that is the tan shade the bottom left then finally we have crepes and crepes is i don't 
know what to explain crepes as. I want to say terracotta, but it's not really orange. Like it's more in the pink color family, but with reddish undertones. So maybe it's considered terracotta. I'm not sure. Comment below what you think uh, crepes looks like. So that's all the mattes in the palette. And then I'm going to go ahead and do the shimmer. So in this one, you get five mattes and four shimmers. So Tarte is the first one I'm going to go into. And this is like an iridescent pink. It looks white in the palette, but it's, ooh, that is, that is pretty. You guys can't even tell on the camera, but that is so pretty. Like the reflect in it, I know that that will look pretty with um, custard. And then next we are going to do macarons, macarons, which is on my eye already. And that I wanted to do like that, you know, um, mint chocolate chip ice cream vibes. So that's that one. Next up we have puffs. And that's a true tone metallic pink, like baby pink. And then finally we have Mont Blanc. And that is a silver. That is her metallics, honey. Let me tell you, her metallics are the shit. Okay, her metallics are bomb. Look at this. Those metallics are everything. 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 Okay. All right. Now that I'm done being dramatic, I'm gonna go ahead and clean my arm off, and we'll come back and do the Saharan Volume One and Two palette. All right guys, first up is the Saharan Blush Volume 1. This is what it looks like. Cute color scheme. And this is the inside. So you get six shades. It looks like you have four actual blushes and then two that could pass for a highlight. So this is what we're gonna swatch now. This is called Neo. This is called Zane. This is called Toby, and this is called Abby. These colors are so rich and so pigmented. It's freaking ridiculous. Like, what? And then you have Zara, which is that bronzy gold, and Lila, which is Zara is, well they're both bronzy gold, but Leela is more bronzy than Zara. So there you have that. And now, on my other arm, my other, other, other arm, we're going to do the volume two. So first up is Yara. Second is Tao. Third is Lena. And fourth is B. And these are all the um like the matte shades inside this blush palette. And now we're going to do the two shimmers, which is Sola. Zoba. Thought I got something on my shirt. So yeah, that's all those. So guys, that's everything. Um, I did use this palette today to do my makeup. So if you're wondering where these eyeshadows are from, that is this palette right here. And again, I got it for $15 at juviusplace.com. So interested head over to the site and grab you one um the blush i'm wearing is the i want to say it's lena because i did try the lightest one just to see what it looked like and it actually doesn't look half bad and then the highlighter i'm wearing is actually rosy Glorez from uh the crown case so i really love this highlighter this is like one of my favorite highlighters ever if you want a highlighter that does not like sit on your top of your skin and it actually like melts and meshes this is the highlighter and the brand to go to she does have some for fair tone skins as well so she has gold she has a pink she has a silver and a 
maroon gold or like a bronze color so um yeah that is all for today's video i hope you enjoyed it i hope you at least got to see something and you know that it uh, helped influence your purchase in a positive direction i know that juvia's place has a lot of bad um videos out there like this brand is kind of controversial and i don't know why i don't know why people have such an issue with this brand whether it be customer service or the woman behind the brand i don't know but anyway i like what i got um they blended very well they're very uh pigmented and proper so if you guys um enjoyed this video please feel free to like comment and subscribe thank you so much for watching and i hope you come back thank you bye